We are back at the Tiki Lounge after a hard day of competition and a harder night of partying. The ice cream truck sold its last popsicle, so support was requested. A truck selling carnivorous plant juice. And the Nissan Junior, with a trailer full of cold brown bottles, are here to keep the cheerful vibe. The crowd is getting refreshed, so let's look at the recap of round one. So there you have it, the odds are in favor of the 5 remaining locals that will smash the track on round 2. Alternator versus Black Pearl the finish line first. Both crashed the track. Sadly, Octonator went for a daily move, denying the win to Black Pearl, that avoided the crash by steering to the left. Too bad that Octonator cut into Black Pearl's path, making it lose its direction and crashing against the bush instead of getting into the monster cave. Octonator goes to the semi-finals. Camaro versus Wild Flower Camaro puts the pedal to the metal and reaches the finish line. But wait! Wild Flower smoothly maneuvers to go for the absolute win. Camaro uses the same strategy that worked on round one. Wild Flower studied those moves and raced keeping it cool, giving us some awesome big air. It controls the landing, maneuvers around the Camaro and gets into the monster cave. This means local versus local in the semi-finals. Full charge versus Shark Week. The two trucks go for it and lose control, but Full Charge recovers and takes a win. Look at how smoothly it reached the finish line. So there you have it folks, Shark Week fiercely attacks a pile of junk cars, forgetting that its true rival is Full Charge. Now, the dirt squad is dealing with a shark wreck instead of a shark rig. Good luck for the next tournament! Good to see a visitor in the semi-finals! Crush Station versus Son of a Digger Crush Station trashes the pile of junk cars. Son of a Digger rolled its way straight into the finish line. Crush Station sinks any chances to win, and Son of a Digger delivers an inelegant race, but elegant enough to get the win. Unfortunately, the bottom feeder won't be making it to the top. The Dirt Squad is here to recover Crush Station. Happily, it didn't suffer any major damage. These are the top four going to the semifinals. Mm -hmm. 
Octonator versus Wildflower. Wildflower falls and Octonator wins. Let's see the race again. Something murky happened. It's clear now. Wildflower was going for the win, but Octonator pushed it to the swamp to see the frogs. This is not fair play, but it's not against the rules. Scoops for being so brave and getting so close to the sarcosuchuses and help with the rescue. We have our first tricky finalist. Full charge versus Son of a Digger. Both jump and roll over, but only full charge makes it. What a clumsy way to get to the finals! Full charge defeated Son of a Digger using its same moves. Son of a Digger will meet Wildflower and race for the third place. Let's see which makes it to the podium. The dirt squad can never take a rest, and we'll know if the bridge is still in condition to hold the weight of monster trucks and heavy equipment. The second finalist is a visitor. Full charge! Wildflower versus Son of Adiga. Wildflower took the win, but not by much. This is undoubtedly one of the most exciting races of the tournament. Both know this is the last chance to reach the podium, so they make their best and aim for the absolute win. So Novadiga gave a great race, but only one goes to the podium. Optonator versus Full Charge Full Charge delivered perfection in this race. The pink truck steers to the right and enters the monster cave aligned. Let's see the race one more time. Octonator lost contact with the track and with reality, allowing it only a second place in this tournament. Karma is back at Octonator, and here we have it, laying on its side, awaiting to be rescued. The podium of Season 1 has been determined. This amusing tournament in honor of the gods of the monster trucks has come to an end. We are contemplating this 24 karat gold idol awarded by these deities to the best driver of the event. The gods command that it's time to celebrate Let's go to the party!
Here we have the top three drivers of season one. The champion of this event, winning for the busy doors, is a full charge, showing all of us excellent driving skills. The second place is awarded to Octonator, not exactly for being a fair player, however, making it to the finals. And on the third place, we have Wildflower, which undoubtedly was the best racer of this event, and that should have reached the finals. Some final words, Bowser? Did you miss the pit party in round one of this tournament? Okay, watch him anyway. Click on the link provided somewhere on this screen. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.